Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to import words from your email, SMS, and social media accounts to your Android keyboard. Now Android has a system user dictionary file that contains words that you've added to your keyboard. Not every keyboard app uses this file though, but the Google keyboard does, as do Minuum and TouchPal. So if you use one of those three keyboards, you might want to check out the latest app from developer Paulino Alessandro. It's called User Dictionary Plus. And basically what it does is find words that you've used in emails, text messages, and social media accounts, then automatically imports them to your user dictionary file. The app is available for free on the Google Play Store, so search it by name to get it installed, then we'll see how it all works. Now right off the bat, it'll ask you to select your preferred language. You can even add multiple languages here, so that should be helpful for bilingual folks. But when you've selected your language, tap the Import button at the bottom of the screen. User Dictionary Plus will now add all of the basic words for that language to your keyboard dictionary. After that, you'll be taken to the app's main menu. But before we get into all of these options, tap the three dot menu button and head to Settings. From here, you can select what types of messages to import from your SMS logs. You can go with Outgoing, Incoming, or both. Next, there's an option to schedule automatic word importing from your various sources. You'll have to run through initial setup first before you can use some of these. Beyond that, there are some options for syncing your keyboard dictionary across devices, but those require that you purchase the Pro version for $1.35. So let's try out some of the sync options. First, head back out to the main menu. From here, you can import words that you've used from various sources. There's Facebook, Twitter, Gmail, and your SMS logs. I'll select Gmail to demonstrate. Next up, tap Yes on the confirmation dialog, then you'll be asked to give this app permission to access your account. So tap OK or Grant when you see this message or something similar, then User Dictionary Plus will scan the account for new words. When that's done, you'll be presented with a list of all the new words that it found. You can individually select the words that you want to add to your dictionary, or you can hit the three dot menu button and choose Select All. After that, tap the Save icon at the top of the screen, then these words will be added to your dictionary. From now on, you can continue using your keyboard as you normally would, but the new words will be added to your dictionary now. For the full breakdown though, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking.